This is the live show. Today we have a special mix by Simulacrum. Here they go. So simulacrum, it, it means like an image or representation of something. And my idea with this like identity is that it's an imperfect replica of myself, mm. right? I'm expressing myself, but it's impossible for me to fully express how I feel or to fully communicate my own experience to someone else. And so it's inevitably always imperfect. So I've been DJing for two years, not too long, but I've been producing for 10. Yeah, how'd you get into that? Actually, someone gave me a free copy of some software, uh, FL Studio, and since then I've just been using it. Kind of clicked immediately, so. So has like the Salt Lake City, that's where you're from, has the house scene there influenced uh, the way that you do your sets? Or are you trying to, since you're in LA, are you trying to like do everything they don't? Um, Salt Lake City doesn't have much of any scene, to be honest. They have a small alternative scene and like a small jazz scene, but outside of that there isn't much. So it's very hard to find places to play, find places to perform. Um, but since I'm in LA because of uh, USC, I think this is a great place to um, share my music. Um, and a computer science major. Yeah. Does, does that help with DJ? So not directly. Mm -hmm. I, I haven't really been able to apply computer science to music in and of itself. That is something I want to do in the future with uh, generative music and there's a lot of cool stuff you can do with that. But uh, programming has helped me make visuals and create like audiovisual performances, which hopefully will be featured on the, um, the video we're playing. But um, I think a lot of, especially for house, not as much for techno, a lot of the performances are no longer just about the music. It's also, it's like a full experience. You have to be there, you have to see the lights, uh, be in the crowd, dance, feel the bass, you know? And a part of that is the visuals and a part of creating like this identity is the visuals and so it's helped a lot with that.
like a lot of my intention with the music I make and DJ is not necessarily just to get people to dance, but it's also to better express how I feel. Mm. Um, I think music is a great way for musicians to express how they feel, but also for others to experience like different emotions, different um, states of being. And visuals help with that very like significantly. Um, I think we're very like both audio and visual like creatures and um, we're affected a lot by what we see and so that can shape a performance a lot. What's your ideal the, like goal for setting? Like, where you the ideal setting would be to organize a, like, a small rave at the Salt Flats in Salt Lake City. Oh, that would and be so, so cool. Just like bring visuals, bring projectors, everything. I think that would be the best best setting for my music. Did you play any instruments or something growing up that like made you want to get into DJing or? I played piano for 15 years and um, also played the drums for mm -hmm. five years. And um, I guess I've always been surrounded by music, but the music that I listened to was largely like house, techno, a lot of produced stuff. And I wanted to make stuff I listened to rather than like perform classical music or jazz, which at the time I did not listen to as much. I think they can both um, express pretty much any feeling. Like with piano, for example, if you master the instrument, you're able to express with the key, key presses. Uh, there's, there's a lot you can do with an instrument. Um, but that requires the precision and skill of years and years and years of practice. And also the knowledge of knowing how your performance affects people. Whereas with production, it's you can kind of preempt a lot of that thought and do trial and error. It's a lot easier to do that. It's easier for me to express with um, production just because I'm able to go back and fine tune very specifically what I want in my songs. Music is always a replica of past music. I, I don't think it's possible to create music from scratch. Like mm. there's always something you hear, something another musician has done that kind of inspires your work. And so your music is always some representation of all the music that people have made. Yeah, so all of my marketing will be through Instagram and uh, there's a video coming out soon, so look forward to that. Society Unnamed, my music collective and I, we're planning a lot with this set, so we're gonna do a video, hopefully some concerts, and so 
If you look up Simulacrum, you should find me. Yeah, yeah it's Simulacrum it's like on underscore dot underscore. All the other ones were taken. But.